Hey there guys, what's up and welcome back to another video from your favorite channel. If we talk about luxury brands, the discussion won't end without even mentioning Louis Vuitton. The company has created such a massive influence on our minds that it's hard to even imagine luxury without LV. Now, the company is making some new and interesting moves and everybody is excited about it. Today, we'll take a look at Louis Vuitton's luxury sneakers made from corn. But before we continue, please be sure to subscribe to our channel and do remember to turn on post notifications so you never miss a video from us ever again. Now let's get started. Number 5. A Brand of the Rich Louis Vuitton is a brand that requires no introduction. The company's products and satisfied customers are a true reflection of what LV is all about. Over the years, it has established a reputation of providing the best accessories and footwear using the most intricate sources for its raw materials, but their designs also receive a lot of praise along with their products. The complex logo featuring just the initials of the brand's name are enough to speak about the company and their products. LV aims to create customers that are wealthy middle-aged women and young influential adults as they provide the brand with significant marketing along with sales. Number 4. Sneakers Made From Corn While the company is still releasing new trends of fashion from time to time, LV is moving one step ahead now. Their new line of shoes is supposed to be coming out very soon and it's unlike anything that we've ever seen from the luxury brand. Their newest innovation could be a turning point in the company's history. Louis Vuitton has successfully created its first sustainable shoe. This time, the company has gone one step further and used incredibly economic materials for this particular line. The shoes are made from vegan corn leather, which is one of the more stable elements as opposed to its competitors. Earlier, the company used polyurethane, but the material isn't as long-lasting as the new one. Biopolioli, which is the corn-based substance taking over polyurethane, is much more durable and will not deteriorate sooner. Along with Biopolioli, Louis Vuitton is using 94% recycled rubber in the shoe's sole, recycled fibers for the laces, and an interesting material called echinol for the tongue patch. This substance is created only from waste materials such as fishing nets, industrial plastic, and old carpets. Number 3. A New Design The shoe is being manufactured at their production plant in Italy. The design is quite intricate, with a simple color and a colored patch at the back. A single LV inscription is present at the side, while the patch at the back has smaller and numerous prints of the brand. It's also the brand's first gender-neutral shoe, meaning that this shoe is available in all sizes and will be in fashion for a very long time. Those that are wondering about the price shouldn't look any further. Louis Vuitton's gender-neutral shoe is available in two forms. A high-top sneaker boot is available for $1,130, while the low-top sneaker goes out for $10,080. However, the design is the same in both of these types, so you don't have to worry about looking for an alternate look. Number 2. LV's Late Switch In terms of sustainable products, LV's Charlie is the first product for the company. But many other brands have taken the step much earlier than the brand. Whether it be sticking to its true luxurious roots or not accepting the public's criticism, LV didn't change its concept for a few years. Now, the brand is starting to make the right moves after a lot of activists persuaded the brand to move towards recycled and sustainable materials instead of original leather. One of the earliest companies to step into the market of recycled materials was Reebok and it took that step four years ago. Many of LV's competitors have already switched towards the eco-friendly manufacture. Gucci released their new sneakers that were made from Demetra, a material that they spent two years on manufacturing. Other brands such as Balenciaga and Dole have also started their production lines with sustainable substances as raw materials. Number 1. Expected Reception The new shoes came out on November 12th. While we haven't seen any marketing strategies from the royal brand, there's no question that the Charlie won't be a success in the market and on television as well. With activities returning to normal after more than two years, people are rushing towards their favorite brands to explore their newest collection firsthand. 
Louis Vuitton recently advertised one of their products in the most influential ways. Using social media influencers to create a sense of fashion among their followers is a big move. With Charlie D'Amelio, LV pursued just that, and the product became a huge success. If the brand brings back the world-famous Chick Chalker back for another marketing campaign, LV's Charlie could become one of the best and fastest selling sneaker pairs of all time for the company and the entire history as well. Well, that's all we have for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, then do give this video a big thumbs up. Be sure to tell us what you think in the comments section below, and do check out the other videos that have come up on your screen. We'll be back here again with more amazing information and news next time, so keep watching and stay tuned.